Alright, hey guys, welcome back to another video. Um, today I'm out here with Austin, and I saw a video recently on YouTube by Gavin May, and it was, he crossed his, um, Skybound springs, like, a different way, and so I took a screenshot of it, and so these are what the springs look right now, so they're all right, they're all like this, and so we're gonna go ahead, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get my phone out, and then we're gonna look at the picture and try to copy as best as possible, and once we do a couple, I'm gonna... I'm gonna update you guys and I'm probably gonna do a time lapse. But yeah, um, once we figure this out, I'll talk. Alright, so we've done a couple, uh, as you can see. And so now let's get Austin, Austin to show you guys how it's done. This one's pretty hard to do, but. Okay, so you just you uh, take all three of those off and then you. So. <laughs> Austin, Austin almost died. Okay, here, let me help you with that. Hold the camera and then you can bang it up. You got two hands, so uh, I can probably do this with actually. Uh, wait. So what you do is you take. So you got that one done, and then you take the three springs out right here. If you want, if you want to show them. So you take these three springs out, and then you leave one in the middle open, and then um, and then you just take these and put it in the middle one, just like so. And um, we already tested this side. And it's already much more bouncy. And at the end, it's going to be more bouncy. It's actually not that bouncy because it's kind of uneven because some of the springs are crossed differently. So, yeah, we're going to do a time lapse right now. All right, guys. So, the joke of the day is, um, so we have a whole, okay, so when you do this, um, you have one extra spring over because there's one spot where you're not actually crossing on. So, we got all these springs. We actually have, like, ten more, and we have all these. We might do something with them, try to like connect them somewhere to make it more bouncy, but so like I'm throwing them into these piles and I like um, stepped back and like shot it like a basketball and I nailed the Joe stick on the camera and the camera fell and um yeah like what Austin just did and the uh, camera fell, I don't know if I was in frame there, but um the camera fell and it deleted the whole uh, clip that I just filmed so yeah let's get the time lapse now.
friend Gavin. He's never been in one of my videos. Bruh. Look at this dude. Um, he's Nate's brother. So, yeah. That's Gavin. He's his brother. I mean, he's, he's all right at flips, you know. Gotta get that. He's gotta get more tricks, you know. That double. You gotta get those double. I want. I want to get a double. It's honestly goodie. the easiest thing ever. Dude, once you get it, it's so easy. No. Uh, all right. My goal by the end of this summer is a Cody mm -hmm. and a double front. All right. Sounds good. That's easy. Something. No. I, no, I can't say. I can That's an that. easy goal. I'll be on a Cody by the end of the year.
is it, bro. Oh, will it ever go in? Yes! Oh my gosh, guys. Okay, so we decided not to just do the Vs all around since we had so many extra ones. So we did this on every other one. Give it a jump test, bro. Oh my god. Oh. You will not, Cody. Okay, guys, we're going to do some new tricks. I haven't even been on it yet. Oh, it's so tight. So that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed us crossing the springs and I hope you learned. Um, actually, so if you want to do what we did, take a screenshot right now. So you do those like that, that one like that, you leave an extra one. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I had a lot of fun filming it. Um, it's so bouncy, dude. A uh, lot more new, bigger tricks before I get uh, a new trampoline. I might keep it a secret. I don't know if I want to tell you guys yet. But, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time on another video. Share this video to someone else.